So how's it going? Or I mean, welcome back, tubes. Very sorry, I forgot about that. But so I got my trimmer here, and uh, I'm trying to get you guys the friggin' uh, damn tripod here. It's just cocked eyed for some reason. There we go. Okay. So you guys are probably wondering what kind of trimmer I've had since uh, I've never made a video of it before. You know, because I just joined YouTube not too long ago, but. But uh, when I joined, you know, I w it was already getting late and stuff in the season to uh, to be doing anything. But uh, I'm going to let you guys guess for three seconds or so, you guess what kind of trimmer I got. Because I don't want to tell you yet. Because it's the best. You know, the best for the best, right? That kind of deal. And I'm surprised that they made them. I didn't... I didn't think they made them, but they did. They made trimmers. Oh, we can read that. Let's see here. Friggin' right, John Deere. Frig, yeah. That's the, uh, let's see here. The model number of it, in case you, tube, friends, want to know what kind of John Deere trimmer this is. It's a John Deere LT105C LE. It's a John Deere trimmer. Has not ran since uh, October. So let's uh, do it. Grammy start. Let me get you guys uh, set up over here. Bring your rights. And uh, I think, if I can show you here, the cats have been gnawing on my damn string. Not that I got a good big roll of it in there yet. So, bring your rights. So, let me, uh, let me make sure I got this camera set right, Tubes, because I don't want you guys to miss out. So, I'm going to bring it up just to, you know, there. Fill it up with gas, and then we'll, uh, freaking, uh, see if this bitch will start. Freaking nice, Tubes. Tubes. Okay, dude, so what I did, I just put in half a tank for right now because I don't know if this gas is still good or not. I think it's still good, but, but, uh, yeah, so let's see if we can make it smoke. Friggin' right, I love smoke. Yeah, we got it going, tubes. She's not smoking, though. That's surprising, but we'll let it run for a while.
Got a little bit of chute coming out of it, but barely anything, though. I don't know if you can tell. Let me kind of readjust this camera here a little bit. But. That little black thing there, that shield is a little bit cocked so I might have to kind of. It seems to be broken, so I might have to buy a new one for it. That's not too good, though. I'll have to try to see if I can maybe re straighten it or something, but I don't know if it's. You can smell the gas burning and shit. But uh, yeah, she is in there when you hit the throttle, but she always, always does that though. I don't know why, but. Now, one year my sister ran it and it fucking. Uh, I don't know, she smoked it up pretty good, but. Uh, seems to be running off pretty right. Definitely chooches, but well, at least she runs. I like this piece of fucking town slut back here, which would run, but fuck. At least we got one thing running. We'll try to get the tractor running tonight, maybe, but don't know. So what I'll do too is I'm just going to end the video right here and I'm going to let it run for me about 5 or 10 minutes and then I'll start the video back up again and we'll see what it does. So I'll see you see it in a bit. Well it's been about there, about 5 or 10 minutes and uh, I'm not freaking doing too much now so I think I'll just top off the tank and then we freaking call it quits on that idea. But uh, yeah I'll probably go and uh, Try out the trimmer a little bit, cut some tall stuff. I got some stuff right there I guess I could cut, but alright, so let's see if this thing will cut a little bit.
So I ordered this big ass fucking drug supply of cocaine. Ugh. Nah, didn't drop it off. You little bastard. Son of a bitch. God. Well, no cocaine for this month. Fucking bullshit, eh? No, I'm just messing with you, Tabs. I don't do that kind of stuff. No. Gotta have some freaking fun, right? So, I guess that's it for today. Maybe I can get the tractor going, maybe, I don't know. I gotta see what my uncle's up to, and, uh... Still gone. Can't find him anywhere. Freak's sake. So, but he'll come around. So, put my tripod. This is the way it was. I'm gonna take off my little thing off my camera here quick. Because I don't need it now. So... We got one thing running anyway, too. The trimmer's back in action. Friggin' right. I love that trimmer. It's actually the best trimmer out there. Yeah, I know some of you guys are gonna say, no, the other brands are better, like that freaking uh, Kawasaki or or whatever the fuck they are. The kind that Bill T Max has got. You guys probably like that kind. I've never heard of that kind. My uncle's got something I think kind of like that, but it's sure in the hell ain't that color. It's red. And, 110 years old, but uh, friggin' right. So, I guess that's friggin' it then. Unless I can make up some other fucking videos, but I doubt it. We're done. We did a Grammy cold start or warm start, whatever you want to friggin' call it, and then uh, and then I uh, I washed the four too. So, but anyway. I guess that's friggin' it, unless my uncle will come over and we can get the tractor back up and running. He's got to get some antifreeze. I keep forgetting to buy antifreeze, so I have to keep hijacking his shit all the time. And, uh, I got to look at the hydraulic oil and the engine oil and make sure it's all fucking right. And, uh, but that's what you want when you're running, you know, equipment. You got to check the oil, you got to check the hydraulics and, uh, check your tire pressure and, uh, and, uh, yeah, check your shits, you know. You gotta check your shits for your for your shit, right? You know, your freaking lawnmower and your freaking uh, your other shit and whatever else there is. So, but uh, yeah, we got the trimmer going. Uh, it's supposed to be kind of like uh the where the, tr the where the trim the freaking line comes out there, your cutting line. Um, most you'd have to, un like, unscrew a thing or something, and then you'd have to fight it, and that's what my uncle says, you gotta fight the damn twine. So I bought this John Deere, and it's like, yeah, I don't, I don't know if you would call it, like, an auto feed, I don't think you would call it that, but what you do is you got, like, a little, uh, little thing on the bottom. What you're supposed to do, you're supposed to just be able to bang it on the ground, and the twine, and as the thing rotates, it's just supposed to fling out the twine as you need it. That doesn't work. I don't know what the hell's wrong, but it works better if I do it by hand. Um, but, uh, you know, I like doing it by hand anyway. I don't want to bang it on the ground. Even though the ground's soft, but you may hit a rock or something and bust it. Then you're all screwed, you know. So I don't bother with that. I just do it by hand. You know, I, I push in the button with my hand and I pull out the twine. I ran out last year, so I got a big-ass fucking roll of it. I think like 300 feet or something like that I got of it. So, I got plenty of twine and, or, you know, cutting twine there, and I got plenty of oil for it, because you gotta mix, uh, you gotta mix that gas and oil shit together. It's stupid, but you gotta do it. And, uh, yeah, I'm getting a little low on that gas now. I may have to mix up some more, but I think I got enough to, to last me half the season anyway. Uh, I think spring is here, boys. Uh, you know, because the grass is growing now and shit. Freaking right. No more snow. Woohoo! No snow. But anyways, you know, if you live around here, that's what you gotta deal with. I guess it is the freaking snow, unless you go south. But uh, fuck whatever, you know. I don't really care. Um, this is the last time you boys are gonna be seeing uh, this wonderful stash of mine. That's coming off tonight, boys. It's gotta come off. So 
We're gonna write. She probably might get a haircut too, I think, uh, sometime this week too. I think, I'm not quite sure. A little cocked out here, but uh, well, it looks better now. But anyways, that's it. I'm going to head in and uh, put the trimmer back away there and uh, put the gas back and uh, and uh, I'll take a Big Red for a spin just to uh, dry his brakes off and make sure there's no water in the transmission or nothing. Um, and then I'll see if I can get a hold of my uncle and maybe we can get the tractor going and stuff and uh, focus your camera. Stupid bitch. But uh, yeah, that's it for right now anyway, unless he comes over later. I know he's not going to want to be in my videos, but that's the point, you know, that it's running now, so. But, uh, well, yeah, so I got to dig out the damn battery. I don't know what I did with the, with the, with the damn battery for the tractor. I think it's down in my basement somewhere. Hopefully the cats didn't tip it over or something, but, you know, I think my mom would have noticed that. She goes down in the basement all the time. I don't, so. So, I'm, um, yeah. Friggin' right, hopefully we can, uh, I don't know if you can see it all that good. Excuse me, you can get that door going. I gotta get, uh, screening for it. Excuse me again. I gotta get, yeah, like I said, I gotta get string, or whatever, uh, shit is the screening. And then, uh, I gotta find some, uh, spray in the can crap. And, uh, we're gonna try to find the one that's not so junky. You know, it's got that lead crap in it and shit. We need shit, you know, without that kind of shit, so. But uh, we'll find it. Sooner or later, we'll find it. And, uh, and then, uh, yeah. So this plane keeps flying around here. I think it's trying to, you know, drop off my drug supply, but I'm not quite sure. You know, but, no, I don't know. They're looking around, you know, they're trying to find stuff. Trying to find me, find dead bodies or something. I don't fucking know, but, Whatever. I got them on YouTube now, so freaking right I did. I mean, hopefully they can fly back this way. Maybe we can get a better view of it. I think it was kind of a white and bluish plane. Uh, just a single engine one. So, freaking right. Anyway, it's a small plane, but I've already been in a plane once, so I don't want to go back into one. I want to, you know, I kind of want to go in a helicopter. I don't know. I like those helicopters more than the planes, but I don't know. Well, I don't know why, but, you know. I think it's because with the helicopter, the rotors kind of help slow you down if you happen to be crashing through the ground. They kind of slow you down a little bit. With a with a regular plane like that, you sink like a rock. That's pretty much well. You're you're you don't even have a chance to see where you're falling. You're dead anyway. So with the helicopter, you know, you may it might kind of slow you down from crashing through the ground. But you know, I suppose if you went to a freaking nosedive or something, then you'd be screwed. But but fuck, you know, whatever. So, um, yeah, so, that's it for today, too, so I guess I'm gonna freaking head in and, uh, and upload this fucking stupid video, and, uh, yeah, there she is, boys. I, I bought it brand new when I, uh, first moved into this house. Fucking, uh, a couple of years ago, I guess it was. I don't know what that is on the bottom there, I don't think that's the model number, but, uh, but, uh, yeah. I do have a book on this, on this piece of machinery. It's got the, uh, it's got the, uh, emergency kill switch. Uh, what you do is you just flip it to off, and then it kills itself. And then that little orange, little red lever right there at the bottom, the big one, right there, that is your, uh, your friggin', uh, your throttle lock. So what that does is that, if you don't have your hand on it, you can't operate the throttle, which is which is very safe. I like that, and but then anyway, it's kind of a pain in the ass. And my one, I don't know if you've seen it or not, but the string kind of does not spin. It's kind of like a floaty thing, I guess. It, it when it's idle, the thing won't spin until you give it more RPMs, and then it starts to spin. My uncle's my uncle's trimmer will spin no matter what the RPMs are of the engine. So even at low idle, the freaking uh, twiner will spin. Um, very dangerous. I don't typically like it too much. I have ran that trimmer for a lot of years, but, uh, no. So we, I just went ahead and bought this here friggin', uh, 
Friggin' uh, friggin' uh, friggin' friggin' John Deere one. Friggin' right. Love John Deere. And, uh, yeah. Here's my, I got two of these, but one, where, this one's just got that John Deere oil and mortar shit in it. I got another one that's empty, but, uh, I was gonna, I, you know, I brought the lawn boy home, and I thought I could, uh, you know, mix up some gas for that. Uh, I might have to do that, because I think we might be mowing pretty quick here. Maybe a couple of weeks yet, but that doesn't hurt to have friggin' shit ready. It's time to get the summer crap re ready to go, and, uh, put the winter shit away. Friggin' right. So... I got a leaf here that's blown away from me, but uh, whatever, it's all right. So um, yeah, I guess that's freaking uh, that's freaking it for today, too. So I'm gonna freaking head in and uh, and uh, freaking uh, do whatever else I do, you know. I'll get uh, this video up going, uploaded for you guys, and uh, we'll freaking uh, see if we can uh, get the John Deere tractor running. And uh, and whoa. And, uh, yeah. So, friggin', yeah, that's... So, we washed Big Red. Man, he's probably over there drying somewhere, and, uh... Yeah, if, if nobody stole him already. Friggin' people. No, nope, he's still here. That's good. Okay. And, uh, we got the trimmer running. And, uh, I topped off the fuel tank now, so now it's good to go. I like to run it out. Friggin' wind. Uh, when it... When uh, October comes and I'm just about done trimming for the season, I will uh, I'll just uh, trim nothing pretty much and I'll run the tank completely dry. Uh, I don't want to do it with the lawnmower because obviously you know it's a bigger engine, so um, I just keep probably about maybe that much, meh, meh, maybe about that much in the tank of the lawnmower for the winter, and then I'll top it off for the summer. Uh, we're going to be going through a lot of gas now because uh, I had to put the rest of my gas in Big Red. I was hoping to at least put a little bit in the lawnmower, you know, even though there's still some in there yet. But I just kind of want to mix the new with the old crap there and uh, see if it'll you know, be a little better or something. But I don't know. So freaking, uh, yeah, tubes, I'm going to head in now, I guess, like I've said, like 10 million times now. And I will, uh, yeah, upload and... Uh, See if we can get the JD up and running and uh, smoke a cigarette. Can't forget about having a cigarette. Even though I don't have any. It's almost sad now, but uh, I can live with it. And, uh, friggin' yeah. So I'll see you tubes later, so have a friggin' good day and, uh, cheat it. Smoke a cigarette. See you tubes later.